other good matches around. We've got um I think Kase Kase is the three is. seed because he beat Smasher. So as long as he doesn't oh, lose. Oh, you're right. And I don't think he's going to lose in Nebula, to be honest. Right, so. It's possible, but. No, it's very possible. Is it plausible? I don't know. Huh. But we've got these two. And these two have fought each other a lot. They're both good friends, good buds. Good player. Yeah, both of them are good players, this too. It's a good set, yeah. And um, I would say Runes has got to be one of the best Falcons at the Sheik matchup. I can think of readily. I know he's one of the best Falcons at the Ryu matchup. <laughs> Yeah, I felt like you were, you had all the right ideas in neutral, but as soon as you were up in the air, it was just like, you're gone. And off stage, he was just relentless. Yeah. In ways that you couldn't be reciprocated because he doesn't have exactly the same mobility. It's a weird, you know, can't react to dash grabs. So I've got to predict when he's going to grab me. Sometimes, right. Sometimes I can, sometimes I can't. It's weird. And so what do you think about this match? Was the matchup that you have played <laughs> in your Falcon, Falcon days? This is Falcon's second or third worst matchup. It's Pikachu and Kirby are really bad. This makes it look not bad. <laughs> right? That, that was they make it eat your words yeah. really quickly. But this Eating is a up. horrible matchup. Like, oh, yeah. It's not I an agree. impossible matchup by any means because Falcon is out of his mind. You know what I mean? He yeah, can no, just I, kill I whenever. That. But He's got that strong, like, smash four potential. Woo. Yeah, yeah. That's true. He does. So Falcon can win, but it's just his, it's very bad. And you're going to see um, Sheik converting a lot more readily on Falcon than you will seeing, like, that kind of an up air string. That's going to be a lot more common. Yeah. And how does, um, I think the other big thing is, how does Falcon get back on stage when she has so many options to kind no, of like just support don't, you? You, don't, you go don't. Off, <laughs> don't go off stage. Like a lot of Falcons will be like, it's matchup's unfair because once you're off stage, you just die no matter what. But yeah, well, don't go off then. Right. Maintain stage, stay in the middle of the stage so that you don't have to jump to get back to the stage. Uh -huh. Like that's easier said than done, obviously, but that is the counterplay. That's like saying, how do I not die from Falcon Punch? Don't get Falcon Punch. Right. <laughs> like this. Nam would never ever let somebody come back from this. Blade right. just does a weird forward air right there, but um, I think that might have, there's something something went wrong with what Blade meant to do in that moment because that should have been free. He had no jump. Right. Should not have come back from that. And I feel like Blade's playing a little antsy right now in his play, just a tad too fast, and that's costing the first stock. Yeah. Shaking his head a little bit. And both of these guys are well, some of the best players I can think of when they're ahead. They're really obnoxious to come back against for different reasons. Living and he saved his jump there too. That was good. Uh, Blade, I definitely agree with that. Runes is kind of like he as a player is very good at not getting come, came back on, but you can always edge guard Falcon. You know what I mean? You can always I throw agree. him off stage and yeah. make something happen. I've been on both ends of that. You know, yeah. <laughs> Falcon killing you at twenty, and then you kill Falcon at twenty pretty readily. Man, this is one thing that is. <laughs> oh my gosh! These up airs. Runes has been a kill percent this whole stock, but he fit in eighty-seven percent. And that's how he's going to die, his cross-stage Vanish. <laughs> From Vanish, yeah. And that wasn't even like an aggressive Vanish. That was just the recovery one. I'm just trying Rune's, to get back on stage, Rune man. stuck his up tilt out there and exploded. That's not going to kill. That was the weakest little back air tap. One of the dumbest killed. nerfs was nerfing Falcon's back air. I know it wasn't like a total nerf. There were some benefits from it possibly. Ner but. Yeah, nerfing his up air is the one that really gets me. That was bad DI, but I think he was going to die anyway. Yeah, he was in a pretty tough position. Falcon's up air used to just straight up kill at like 110, 120. Yeah, up air is still so good though now. And it's I feel a like great all the Falcons you saw, in the especially last, in that game. Especially in the last year and a half, I feel like the Falcons have gotten so annoying with their up air. Like that's the one thing that's improved the most. Yeah. Because I feel like I fight runes, I fight Seth, and no matter who I'm fighting, I'm taking 40, 50 damage consistently. You that's the difference. You can't argue that it wasn't a nerf. Like it was a nerf in the knockback, but up air and knee would be a lot harder, more narrow percent if it had more knockback like it used to. Uh huh. Because um, up air knee used to, it was always a thing, but it was a lot oh, the harder because up air didn't used to be safe on shield uh -huh. before the shield right. burf. Right, exactly. Burf. That was like buff and nerf at the same The shield change, I guess. The shield change, yeah, that's fair. Yeah, so now you can put it on shield, so it's like Falcon's go to neutral thing. It feels like she, um, Blade is playing a lot more confident at the ledge right now and just kind of trapping in different ways. Like, he's not trying to force something off stage. He's also just like, I can catch your roll, I can catch your neutral get up, I yeah. can catch your whatever option because <laughs> Sheik is so good at frame trapping like that. I like the way that Blade's been varying his pressure a lot this game. And Sheik's spot dodge is actually like really good. Like I swear like Sheik will like spot dodge twice <laughs> in the amount of time yeah. that I like try and grab. Uh, people say Sheik's got great frame data and they don't realize that applies to her defense just as much as her offense. Right. Her rolls, her spot dodges, yep. and her air I dodge agree. is one of the more fast ones. Oh man. Runes is brutal with these up airs this whole set. Yeah, I, he, he's been just brutal with them all day. I love that. Uh, fade back. Did you see the Phantom? Yeah, that he was good. He got the spark. Like, like the 
hitboxes. Runes that you're saying, right? Rubbed against each other. No, Blade. Oh. Bl well, Runes' weave back. Yes. Created a situation where he was just, just one pixel out of range of the back right. air. It was really good. Nice air dodge read. And Blade is so good with those cross-up up airs. Yeah. Like, I have no idea what way to well, DI. I don't either, because it's hard to look at Sheik and tell which way you're supposed to go. And you basically can't react to it, so I'm at a point where I'm almost so afraid of it that I'm just going to not DI left or right, because it's I'd rather the die trajectory. at 105 than 92. Like <laughs> because you held, because you went straight up. Because yeah. I was like, this is the way I normally DI. And yeah. I'm like, uh-oh. <laughs> That's a good, that is a good uh, approach to it. Honestly, it's like, would you rather be consistent or would you rather get greedy? And I'm a man of greed. But I'm not trying to die to Sheik before 90%. <laughs> I love that Tomahawk. Yeah, that was good. Yeah. I love Tomahawks in Smash 1. Honestly. Every Tomahawk is awesome. Yeah. No such thing as a lame Tomahawk. I agree. I mean, Foxes are less impressive, but <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. just keeping it real. But, like, you know. You know who's got the best Tomahawks? Shout out to uh, Daybreak. They, I Tom, hate the, the Daybreak The Tomahawk and this guy I've ever played in my life. <laughs> That's fair. He just is, like, jumping around him like, stop not oh, that. Man, this is the same as the last game, but reverse. Like one yeah. the first whoever takes first stock. Whoa! I hate bouncing first. <laughs> that, that was, was so dumb. good though. Yeah. That was so like I would have never seen that coming. You know yeah. what I mean? Forward throw kills. Alright, so I it's hate not gonna be a, We're not gonna trade two stocks. And then if she you got hate kill, kill throws? throws? Yeah, I hate What did kill you just throw. say to me? Hey. The I next character, since 2015. Hey, if you got good frame data, you shouldn't have a good uh, kill throw. Fact. Also, are you saying that who, like, did he kill throw? Who? Falcons? Yeah, back uh, Fal I, Falcons fourth throw isn't really a Ooh! That was, he almost won the set right there. <laughs> I uh, mean, he had the read. Don't DI in on Falcon, guys. Falcons please. grabs killing is is dumb just because of how they're all, he also has the best combo throws. Right. <laughs> I think I hate dying to a jab more. <laughs> how many times I've jumped, I'm like, I'm going to neutral get just one more time into seven. Oh, yeah. so if, well, if you die to jab, that means that you've made it to 170, so you should be dead anyway. <laughs> yeah. But wow, goes deep. That's, that's it. <laughs> wow, wow, that comeback! Holy cow! Rune's undefeated. I think he's yeah. He went five and zero. There's only right? going to be like two undefeated players because there was four people that were four and zero this round. Rune uh -huh. wins once. I don't know who's going to who the other.